Greetings and salutations, my excellent friends. And here are this week's top stories. Apparently, holidays are popping up all over the place because last week was Caps Locks Day. That means you talk on Twitter in all caps. Oh. So, like, you're yelling at everybody all the time. It's actually a very self explanatory thing. Yeah, I guess I really didn't have to explain that. Okay, well, here are some tweets from this new holiday, Caps Locks Day. At Sir CC said, it's hashtag Caps Lock Day. Remember, I'm not yelling at you when you read this. But I can't read it any other way. Some people are hungry on Caps Lock Day. PJ Posero said, I need some pizza. Hashtag Caps Lock Day. Even big companies are getting into Caps Lock Day. At Brisk said, nope, definitely not doing this. Hashtag Caps Lock Day. Well, I think you are inadvertently in it. And IHOP said, Loud noises! Hashtag Caps Locks Day. And some people are taking this holiday a little too seriously. Duran Francis said, There was never an us! Hashtag Caps Lock Day. Everything will be alright. Everything's going to be okay. Breaking news. The Chicago Cubs have just signed former Red Sox, Indians, Dodgers, outfielder Manny Ramirez to a AAA contract as a player coach. So not only will he be playing for the team, he'll be molding young minds because if there's one person you want molding the young minds of ball players, it's Manny Ramirez. Let's see what Twitter has to say. At Johnny Croco tweeted, Manny Ramirez is taking after Jackie Moon, the OG player coach. Jackie Moon in the Flint Tropics. Hopefully if Manny gets hurt, they don't carry him out and not use a stretcher. Jackie's teammates doing a horrible job of supporting his back and neck. At Ashy Love 77 tweeted, Manny Ramirez and Mentor. Never thought I'd hear those in the same sentence. Me neither. Unless his nickname became The Mentor. And they started a TV show on CBS to go against The Mentalist. Anyway. At Terrence Malone tweeted, Pretty pump we got Manny Ramirez, hoping to do drinking activities with the Predator. I sincerely hope that is Manny Ramirez's nickname because that's probably the greatest nickname I've ever heard. For those of you living under a rock, and I sincerely apologize if you actually do live under a rock, but J.J. Abrams is filming the new Star Wars movie. I know, not groundbreaking news. But what is groundbreaking news is that he is giving you, the fans, a chance to be in the new Star Wars movie by entering and donating to a charity. So let's see what Twitter had to say and let's see why they think they should be in Star Wars Episode Seven. Can I be in it? You could be in it. You gotta donate. Ten bucks gets you one entry. I don't donate to charity. That's terrible. Some people are just finding out about this Star Wars contest. Dave W said, You can enter a contest to be in Star Wars? Question mark, exclamation point, question mark, exclamation point, and lots of emoticons? You can. And you will, I bet. You should enter it. Let me know. It could be the next, uh, next big star. Some people already have their roles picked out for them. Joseph said, if I win this Star Wars contest, I want to be the one that rescues Boba Fett out of the Sarlacc pit. Dream come true. Now that's the best thing you could possibly do in a Star Wars movie. The new one. You gotta rescue Boba Fett. And I immediately take that back. Because Theater of Sci-Fi said, J.J. Abrams announced Star Wars cameo contest. Winner gets the cock punch Jar Jar Binks. And I think that that is the better option... Then rescuing Boba Fett. That's the way to go. And those are this week's you know, top... It's, it's funny that you should say something about tickets. I didn't say anything about tickets. No, I'm glad you said that. You know, there's a reason I'm wearing this shirt right here. And that's because uh, Friends Company of ours, the best seats in the house tickets. Now, everyone wants to go to a concert or sporting event every now and again. You got to use the best seats in the house. Not only for Boston, but worldwide. Any ticket, any show, any concert, any sporting event you want to go to, you go to them. Because if you go to anybody else, you're overpaying. Hey, do you think you get me uh, tickets to see Nora Jones? Absolutely. He, I mean, you can meet Nora Jones. I could meet Nora Jones. You could give her a back rub. I could give her a back rub. All right. Well, best seats in the house. You heard it here first. And those are this week's top stories. <laughs> Be sure to tune in next week, same time, same great place. YouTube.com/slash The Average Nobodies. And uh, while you're on the YouTube page, why don't you subscribe to our page, like all our videos, you know, play around on the computer, nerd. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and while you're at it, follow us on Twitter, at Average Nobodies. We're constantly putting out some good tweets. I mean, I think we're good tweets. We live tweet. 
a lot we're, of stuff. Raw. We're, we're, we have the pulse. We have we are on the pulse of society. Mm -hmm. So if you want to follow us if you want to know what's going on. CNN ain't got shit on us. Remember, check out the blog, AverageNobodies.com. And until next week, I'm Mateo. I am Ryan O. Suck today's Okay, go f*** yourself, everybody. <laughs>